Hello everyone. Imagine we have two elements on the page. The first one shows the current date. And the second element, the message, includes that date in its part. We can confirm that wherever the first element displays is actually included in the message element. So here's how we do it. First, we need the first element. We're going to get it using its ID, current, date. From that element, we need the text. So we're going to get it by invoking the text method, which comes from jQuery. And then anytime you use something from the page, you have to use set then callback. That's where the value will be yielded to. Okay. Now we need the second element and the simplest command to check if there is a message element is to use a contains command and pass the value of text that we got. Perfect. So we checked that there is an element with ID message that includes the text from the first element. I can also see that there is a node class inside the message that precisely has the date. So we can be more precise and say, get me the element with class, I mean, ID message and inside class node. And that element should have text and a value of text. So no longer it checks if it's a substring, it checks precisely that this element contains whatever we passed as a current value. 